Hello everyone. Welcome to JJK Master Class. Guys, in today's video, we will see the difference between absolute and relative error. How to calculate it and we will see the previous year problem from BCU University on this topic. The topic is also important for competitive exams like CSIR NET and GATE examination. The question is taken from MSc previous year chemistry students. So the question is in a gravimetric analysis, the sample weight is noted as 0.235 gram instead of 0.0235 gram, find the absolute and relative error. So here the noted weight means it is the measured value. So we will find the first formula for absolute error. What is the uh, formula for absolute error is xi minus xt where xi is the measured value and xt is the true value or the accepted value. So in the above problem, how to find out which is measured and which is true value, as you can note down, sample weight is noted as 0.235 means it is a measured value. So it will be represented as xi and the true value is given as 0.0235. So we will calculate the absolute error by subtracting the two values and you will get the answer 0.2115 gram as absolute error. Now the formula for relative error is the absolute error divided by the true value. Absolute error we have just now calculated. So that is xi minus xt divided by the true value into normally uh, relative error is calculated as uh, percentage. So we will multiply here with 100 and you will get the answer 900%. So the relative error has been calculated as 900%. So if the problem comes uh, on the topic like you have to calculate the absolute and relative error, you can learn the above formula. Absolute error is measured value minus true value and the relative error is the absolute error divided by the true value into 100. In percentage, we measure the relative error. So I hope uh, now if the problem comes on the above topic, you can uh, solve these uh, problems, uh, this type of problems. I have already uploaded some more uh, videos on uh, errors, chemicals analysis. Okay, errors in chemical analysis. You can find out that in the description box. Happy learning. Mm -hmm.